Hello and welcome to Cataclysm Quick Tip number 58 where I'm going to discuss and demonstrate a custom vehicle. This will be vehicle number one in a hopefully ongoing series of custom vehicles that I'd like to demonstrate for folks, both to give them ideas about uh, how to design or modify vehicles in Cataclysm for the best use and or just kind of show off some of the things that are possible to kind of get the creative juices flowing uh, to encourage people to experiment in their own games and see what kind of cool things they can come up with. So in this first episode for a vehicle edition, uh, we're going to start with something small. I call him my little friend and I'm going to demonstrate driving him around first and then we'll show how it's put together. So let's go ahead and uh, move north to the parking lot here. And here he is. We're just going to hop right in, start it up, and there we go. We are driving. So this particular vehicle has got a few features that are pretty useful. We're going to uh, set our targeting mode to automatic for our laser cannon. And we're going to go visit the local town. Just north of us, we've got a town. Let's see what kind of trouble we get into as we drive up towards the town. Hey, zombie! Goodbye, zombie. Hey, other zombies. <laughs> Oops. Turn the vehicle. Turn the vehicle. <laughs> All right. There's a few too many zombies right here in this area. Let's go ahead and spin it around. And we'll head back the way we came. And we're tearing that bus apart, or that cargo truck. Making a bit of a mess. That's fine. Alright, we'll kick the speed up a bit while we make our return trip back to the base. And there we go. So I call this my little friend, and I also call it the laser death cart. Here is why. Let's stop drinking it, or stop driving and take a look. So, there's the vehicle. Laser death cart. Um, it's a single space vehicle, so it's kind of what I wanted to show off, is kind of the things you can accomplish. Now, some of the things I'm going to demonstrate are not typical vehicles. You're not likely going to be able to build these in most games that you run across. But it is good for just kind of demonstrating the options that are available. So, a couple things to note. It is a single tile vehicle. In order to move in a single tile vehicle, I have to use four inch casters. That's basically what you've got on shopping carts and things like that. Uh, if you put a single tire on the vehicle, it won't actually be able to move with just one tire. So you have to go with the four inch casters. I've also gone with an electric battery or electric motor and a storage battery. Um, there's certain things you have to have in certain positions and trying to go with a gas motor just won't quite work with this kind of a setup to get everything else on here. So to kind of go down the list, we've got the frame it sits on, diamond plating for extra studliness, sturdy power, laser cannon turret, stereo system, clock, inboard mirror, reinforced wide angle headlight, turret mount, seat belt, controls, dashboard, reclining seat, the enhanced electric motor, the storage battery, and the 4-inch casters. That's it. And with all that set up, we've got a safe speed of 129, top speed of 135, the big downside to this particular vehicle is right here. Off-road, though, it's only going to be 10%. So 13 safe speed and 13 top speed. Um, so as you can see, the off-road is going to be pretty rough. That's because it's a fairly heavy thing on 4-inch shopping cart casters. Not exactly off-road uh, efficient. So as long as you stay on the roadway, though, this will make an excellent little zippy death cart mobile. It has no storage. That's up to you. Carry your own gear. Um... Couldn't fit it in with the other components that are involved. But as you can see, with that quick trip we took up north, even with us firing the laser cannon turret fairly often in that little jaunt, we still only burn the battery down to 61%. And then next to it here, we've got a generator that I use to uh, just burn some gasoline for some energy and recharge the battery as needed. But that is a single space laser death cart that you can use to zip around with and get some ideas on what kind of fun things you can do with vehicles. Look forward to future episodes with more traditional vehicles, modified Humvees, security vans, SWAT trucks, uh, luxury RVs, tanks, all that kind of stuff. I'll kind of pepper them into the various quick tip episodes, just like I'm going to do with the 
various home base designs. So if you enjoy this kind of content and information, let me know in the comments and uh, I will be happy to provide more as we go along. Hope you found the information helpful. As always, thanks for your support and stay safe out there.